Across the Caribbean, we continue to see tranquil conditions, dry weather, also drought warnings in effect for many islands. Out towards the west, we continue to see the windy conditions along the Colombian coastline, and that's all courtesy of the high pressure, which has built towards the north. Not much in terms of rainfall is expected here. Meanwhile, out towards the Atlantic, we do have a dying cold front system set to possibly bring a few clouds as we get towards the latter half of the weekend, possibly early next week across the southern Windward Islands. And that's good news. Any sort of moisture will count as we go through this harsh, dry season. So across the Greater Antilles, Kingston remains windy alongside Port-au-Prince. A stiff breeze expected along the coastline of Hispaniola with some brisk showers as well for Santo Domingo. Highs of 31 degrees Celsius expected there. Out towards the eastern Caribbean, very little is expected to change over the next few days. The winds continue across St. Kitts and Antigua, gusty at times, and also this will have an effect out at sea, and the breezy spells expected for Dominica, as well as down to St. Lucia, and across Bridgetown as well. They'll notice the flags flapping as they go through Saturday and Sunday. And down towards Georgetown, it remains a partly sunny, just occasional clouds expected as they go through the next few days as well. So that's your Caribbean travel forecast, and that's it from me.